reactions. It means it does not involve in any reactions. And another one, no new substance will form it in the physical chain. What is mean by physical chain? It does not involve any chemical reaction and no new substance will be formed. Examples of the physical chain? Yes, melting of wax, melting of water, chopping of the vegetables. Yes, this is the examples of physical chain. It's opposite chemical chain. What is mean by chemical chain? Good. Chemical chain, it do involve chemical reaction. It do involve chemical reaction. In the changes, it new substance is formed. Yes, it will involve in the chemical reaction and new substance will be forming. Examples of the chemical change? Yes, very good. Respiration, photosynthesis, burning of the paper is the examples of the chemical change. Before the lesson, now we are discussing chemical reaction. Now, what is mean by chemical reaction? Chemical reaction, it is the process. Interaction of chemicals to form a new chemical. What is mean by chemical reaction? It is the process. Interaction of chemicals to form new chemicals. In other words, common words are missing. One or two substances combine to form new substance. That is the chemical reaction. What is mean? One or two substances combine to form new substance. That is also called chemical reaction. When magnesium is burned in oxygen, when magnesium is burned in oxygen, they will form magnesium oxide. They will form magnesium oxide. After the chemical reaction, what will be happening? They will, that is, change in state, change in color, change in temperature, change of a gas. After the chemical reaction, what will be happening? Change in state, change in color, change in temperature, change of a gases. Now, we are discussing chemical equation. This magnesium is burned in oxygen before magnesium oxide. We are writing it is in the form of chemical equations. Mg plus O2, MgO. Mg plus O2, MgO. Mg means magnesium. O2 means oxygen. Magnesium oxide means MgO. This side we are calling LHS side. This side we are calling RHS side. LHS side we are calling reactant. RHS side we are calling product. Reactant means what? Who take part in chemical reaction? Who involve in the chemical reaction? That one we are calling reactant. Which will form? The substance which are formed, that one we call a product. The substance which are formed in chemical reaction. After the chemical reaction, what will be forming the, that one we are calling product. It means what is mean by chemical equation? Chemical equation is a symbolical representation of chemical reaction. It is the symbolical representation of chemical reaction that involves uses of formula and symbols. Chemical equation is the representation of symbols and formula. It is represented by chemical reaction. It is represented by chemical reactions. We are discussing how to balance chemical equations. We are taking one chemical equation. Fe plus H2O along of Fe3O4 plus H2O. This is this is this is unbalanced chemical equation. This one we are calling skeletal chemical equation, which is the unbalanced chemical equation. That is we are calling the skeletal chemical equation. After the skeletal equation, we have to balance the skeletal equation. First, we have to make the boxes of each element. Here I made already boxes of each element. After the steps, we have to take a how much elements are performed in the chemical equations? We have to write in the boxes inside. Element, which elements are performed in the chemical equations? Fe, hydrogen and oxygen. In the reactant side, Fe how much is there? 1 is there. And hydrogen how much is there? 2 is there. Oxygen how much is there? 1 is there. And in the 
products are can be how much is it? Three hydrogen, two oxygen, four. After this box, we have to multiply which is the highest number elements is found in the chemical reaction. That is high oxygen one into four four. It means in the products are how much elements are is there? Four is there. That's why in the reactants also we have to balance the chemical equation. After this we have to write the chemical equation Fe plus four H two O aroma Fe three over plus H two O. After this now we have to correct is there not is there we have to check it once. Fe four into H two A. Now hydrogen will be imbalanced. Hydrogen will be unbalanced. Now two into four A. And two into four eight. It means reactant side and product side both are balanced. Now we have to write the next equations. F e plus four H two O. F e three over four H two. Now hydrogen and oxygen are balanced. Now we have to move. Iron is balanced or not balanced? Now still iron is not balanced. Now multiply how much product side iron is there? Three is there. In the reactant side how much is there? Only one is there. Now we have to multiply. One into three equal to three. Write the three in front side. Now three Fe plus four H two O. Aroma Fe three O four plus four H two. After this, we have to mention their physical state compulsory. In the balance equation, we have to mention their physical state. In three Fe, how which state is a solid state? And H two O which state is a gas state? And Fe three O four is which state is a solid state? Example, note down. 